OK, so let's say we want to solve 4 sine x plus 5 cos x equals 0 between 0 and 360 degrees. Now, for this one, what we're going to need to do is rearrange it uh, to get it into a format that we can actually solve. We're actually going to use one of the trig identities. So what you can do is you can divide both sides of the equation by cosine of x. So we get 4 sine x over cos x plus 5 cos x over cos x equals 0 over cos x, which is just 0. So 4 sine x over cos x is 4 tan x. And 5 cos x over cos x is just 5. So we're actually wanting to solve this equation. So by subtracting 5 from both sides and then dividing by 4, we're actually solving the equation tan x equals minus 5 quarters between 0 and 360. So if we sketch tan okay, between 0 and 360, minus 5 quarters somewhere down there. So we can see that we're getting two solutions here. OK, so first of all, inverse tan of minus 5 quarters is minus 51.3 degrees to 3 sig fig. Now, that solution is over here. So I want to add on 180 degrees to get to the next solution. So I'm adding on the period of tan. Oh, sorry. So add on 180, and we get 129 degrees to 3 sig fig. That's between 0 and 360, so that's that one there. And then we add on another 180. to get our second solution, which is 309 degrees to 3 sig fig. And so x must be 129 degrees or 309 degrees to three significant figures. They are the two solutions between 0 and 360 that solve the original problem.